Hi, and welcome to part two of the Azure Perfu Quick Start series. My name is Wolfgang. You want to know what's inside Azure Perfu. You want to know what are the pieces that put Azure Perfu conceptually together. Then you're right. So let's stay tuned and dive into the Azure Perfu architectural overview. So what's inside Azure Perfu? Well, we want to analyze, we want to catalog our data sources. So data sources are required. Different pieces of data sources, databases, uh, files, um, data lakes, maybe clouds, maybe Azure, maybe other cloud vendors. So we want to get an overview about all our data estates. So what is needed to get the information? out of these data sources? Well, we need scanners. We need some sort of plugins. We need some sort of technology that scans the structure of the source systems and imports that one into direction Azure Perfu. Next is data classification. It's not only the technical part that is done by the scanners. So we've got a database table, we've got the schema, we've got data types uh, assigned to columns and so on. But we also want to know where are email addresses, where are customer numbers, where are passport numbers stored. So classification is an important part. And there are two parts. First, there are those automated scanners. So those automated scanners, they are really working during or after the scan process. And they uh, try to find the right piece of data, to find uh, the right uh, classification and assign it to. After that, well, there is some sort of data map built. The data map, it consists of the assets. The asset can be a table, it can be a column, it can be a Power BI data set, it can be a file or a directory in a data lake. So an asset is a piece of data information somewhere in your data map. Those pieces are put together. So we are building, or not we, Perfu is building a data map and some sort of hierarchy. And that hierarchy also includes the process and the data flow, the data supply chain, as we heard in the first video. So where comes my data, where goes my data to, and what are the steps that are involved? So the data map is the result of scanners and the classification. And now for the users, we need some sort of data catalog in order that they are able to a search within your data catalog. And there is some sort of additional work involved for your business users, edit, maintain, and publish a business glossary. And the business glossary terms, they can be, and they are applied to data assets in your data map. And last but not least, data lineage can be uh, analyzed using the data catalog. So graphical user interface for everything like that. In addition, it's the data insights that really makes it interesting to see how many scans are there, how many files are included in the data catalog. So another piece of information about your metadata, about your data map. As I said, there are built-in scanners. So scanners that are able to analyze uh, SQL Server, Azure SQL databases, files in the data lake. But if there is no built-in scanner, well, Azure Perfu is built on Apache Atlas, the open source data governance solution. And there is an open API that you can use uh, to query your data map and to add additional metadata. So you are not limited to the scanners that are in there. And with that, that was a quick overview about the internals of Azure Perfu. I hope you enjoyed it. Please give me feedback, subscribe to my uh, YouTube channel and see you next time. And today, thanks for having a look at Azure Perfu Quick Start Series, what is inside Azure Perfu. Thanks, goodbye.